Have you ever wondered if your baby remembers your voice even before they're born? What about a song you played during pregnancy or a bedtime story you read out loud? It sounds unbelievable, but science says yes. Babies can actually remember sounds from the womb. And not just for a few minutes or hours. Some studies suggest that newborns can recognize sounds they heard months before birth. But how does this work? How much do babies really remember? And can you actually shape your baby's future learning by what they hear in the womb? Let's dive into the fascinating world of prenatal memory and find out what your baby might already know before they even open their eyes. If you love learning about the hidden wonders of pregnancy, make sure to like, subscribe, and stick around until the end, because this one's going to change the way you think about your baby's early development. When can babies start hearing? Your baby's journey into the world of sound begins before they ever take their first breath. One, at 16 weeks, their ears start forming, but they don't hear much yet. Two, by 26 weeks, their hearing becomes more advanced and they begin reacting to loud noises outside the womb. Three, by the third trimester, they can recognize patterns, rhythms, and even specific voices and songs. That means your baby isn't just hearing sound, they're actually learning from it. But how do we know they can remember what they hear? The science of prenatal memory researchers have conducted incredible studies that prove babies remember sounds from the womb. In one study, pregnant mothers read the same short story to their babies every day in the final six weeks of pregnancy. After birth, scientists measured the baby's brain activity when they heard the same story. And guess what? They recognized it. Another study played a specific melody to unborn babies repeatedly. After birth, those same babies reacted differently when they heard the melody again, showing that they had stored it as a memory. So yes, your baby can remember sounds from the womb, and that memory lasts beyond birth. But why does this happen? And what does it mean for your baby's development? Why babies remember sounds from the womb? Your baby's ability to remember sounds before birth is a survival mechanism. From an evolutionary standpoint, recognizing a familiar voice or sound right after birth helps babies feel safe and connected. Here's how it benefits them. One, early language learning. By listening to your voice, babies start recognizing the rhythm and melody of language before they even understand words. Two, emotional bonding. Your baby feels comforted by familiar sounds, which is why many newborns calm down when they hear their mother's voice. Three, memory and cognitive development. The more exposure babies have to certain sounds, the more their brains form connections that help with future learning. So when you talk, sing, or read to your baby before birth, you're already shaping their early brain development. What types of sounds do babies remember? So what exactly sticks in their memory? One, your voice. This is the number one sound babies recognize and prefer after birth. One, studies show that newborns turn their heads toward their mother's voice more than any other sound. Two, songs and music. If you play the same song often during pregnancy, your baby might recognize and react to it after birth. Three, repetitive sounds. Rhythms like heartbeat patterns, lullabies, and even daily household noises can become familiar. Four, stories and spoken words. If you read the same book out loud regularly, your baby might recognize the story's cadence after they're born. This is why many parents find that singing a lullaby or playing familiar music helps soothe their newborns, because those sounds have already become part of their world. How can you help your baby build positive memories? Now that we know your baby is actively listening and learning, how can you use this knowledge to help them before birth? One, talk to your baby daily. It may feel silly at first, but your baby loves the sound of your voice. Talk about your day, describe what you're doing, or simply say, I love you. Two, read the same story every night. Pick a favorite children's book and read it regularly. After birth, that story could be a powerful comfort tool when your baby is fussy. Three, play music soft. Repetitive music, especially the same song played often, can help create positive associations that may last after birth. Four, encourage your partner to talk to baby. Babies can remember both parents' voices, so let your partner talk to your belly too. What happens after birth? The effects of prenatal memory don't stop at birth. Many newborns show signs of remembering sounds they heard before they were born. One, 
Babies recognize and prefer their mother's voice over a stranger's. Two, some babies calm down when they hear a familiar lullaby or book that was read during pregnancy. Three, studies show that newborns cry in different rhythms depending on the language they heard in the womb, meaning they are already absorbing the sounds of speech. Your baby's early memories are shaping their future learning and emotional security long before they take their first breath. So can babies really remember sounds from the womb? Absolutely. From recognizing their mother's voice to responding to music and stories, babies are actively learning before they're even born. And the best part? You have the power to shape those early memories in a positive and loving way. So go ahead, talk, sing, and read to your little one. They're already listening, and they just might remember. If you found this fascinating, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share for more incredible insights into pregnancy and baby development. And tell me, what's the first song or story you'd want your baby to remember? Let me know in the comments.